First time ever I saw your face was Roberta Flack's first number one hit record in 1972. Roberta was born into a musical family in Asheville and grew up in Arlington, Virginia, where she studied classical piano. Roberta won a full music scholarship at the age of 15 to attend Howard University in Washington, D.C. She graduated at the age of 19. The death of her father brought Roberta back to North Carolina, where she taught music and English at a Farmville Elementary School for a year. She then returned to the Washington area and continued to teach school. It was during this period that Roberta's professional music career started to take shape. She played piano for the opera singers who strolled into DC's posh Tivoli Club. During intermissions, Roberta would sing and play blues and folk songs and pop standards on an old upright piano in the back. One thing led to another, and she started working two to three nights a week at another club, playing solo piano and singing. When her voice teacher told Roberta that there was a brighter future in pop music than the classics, she started reshaping her repertoire. By the summer of 1968, the word was out that Roberta was a singer on the rise. While she was doing a benefit for the Inner City Ghetto Children's Library Fund, one of the people in the audience was famed musician Les McCann. Within days, he'd arranged an audition for Roberta with Atlantic Records. Her premiere album, First Take, was recorded in just 10 hours. Three more albums followed, and in 1972, Clint Eastwood chose First Time Ever I Saw Your Face for his movie, Play Misty For Me. The song was pulled from Roberta's first album and released as a single. It soared to number one, and Roberta Flack was on her way. Only to be followed by another smash hit with Donny Hathaway. Roberta continued to collaborate with Donny Hathaway and later with Peebo Bryson. Producing, writing, and touring kept Roberta busy through the mid-80s and early 90s. 22 albums later, along with a string of hits, she was honored with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame in 1999. Tonight, we honor Roberta Flack as a North Carolina artist who's helped shape American music. <laughs> 